Andrew from I Hate Hamlet. Paul Rudnick. Last night, right from the start, I was bombing. I sounded big and phony. Real the and thou. And then I started rushing it. What's new in Denmark? I just could not connect. I couldn't get a hold of it. And while I'm babbling, I look out. There's this guy in the second row. A kid like 16. Obviously dragged there. And he's yawning and jiggling his legs and reading his program. And I just wanted to say, hey kid, I'm with you. I can't stand this either. But I couldn't do that. So I just keep feeling worse and worse. Drowning. And I thought, okay. My questions are answered. I'm not Hamlet. I'm no actor. What am I doing here? And then I get to the soliloquy. The big job. I'm right in the headlights and I just thought, Christ, the hell with it. Just do it. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether tis no but the mind to suffer, the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles and by opposing end them and to die to sleep no more. And I kept going and I finished the speech and I look out and there's the kid. He's listening. The whole audience. Complete silence. Total focus. And I was Hamlet. And it lasted about 10 more seconds. And then I was in hell, and I stayed there. And for that one speech, for that one little bit, I got it. I had it. Hamlet. And only 8,000 lines left to go.